going to talk a little bit now about a partnership between Ericsson and a Swedish-based company called Cole Morgan, who are testing for in, uh, testing 5G for industrial robots. And so, you know, as I said, Cole Morgan is a Swedish-based manufacturer, and the company joined Ericsson's Industry 4.0 partner program last April. And they're now exploring how 5G can enhance mobile robots in partnership with Ericsson, and they're working to prove that the company's NDC solutions are 5G ready. And so I thought this was interesting. And, and again, you know, we're going into Mobile World Congress and, and, you know, lots of cool things will be on display there, including things like this. And so what, what's happened is that um, Cole Morgan has performed tests that so far appear to be promising. They're testing 5G capabilities against Wi-Fi. And the tests were run using a private 5G network setup, you know, something that we talk a lot around about around here in addition to trials in a 4G public network. And what they're trying to do is they're trying to show that Cole Morgan's NCD solutions are communication agnostic, which is kind of a big deal. And the recent test switched a Wi-Fi comms link with a 5G one in one of the vehicle control units. And the results were that there was absolutely no difference in stability on either the 5G or the Wi-Fi network. That's what you want, right? And so Cole, Cole Morgan's NDC, I think I said it incorrectly last time, NDC products include hardware, software, navigation capabilities that help improve the efficiency of autonomous guided vehicles, um, which are used in manufacturing and warehouse settings. And, and the company's clients are not small. They include companies like Toyota Material Handling Europe and Jung Heinrich AG, and I probably butchered that, um, Mitsubishi's Logis Next Europe, and others. And uh, the company's products are also used by makers of AGVs in creating driverless logistics automation solutions. So I thought that this is, you know, we, we do a lot. We're actually working on a research project right now focusing on warehousing, automation, robotic solutions. And so this caught my eye. And um, you know, and I think that um, props here to programs like Ericsson's Industry 4.0 Partnership Program, because being able to partner with companies who are doing and developing cool solutions like this and, you know, using the expertise and the technology of Ericsson and their team, um, you know, that's how we get, we've talked a lot here before, Ron, about smart partnerships and they're how they are really the key to great progress moving forward. And I think this is an example of a smart partnership and, and getting some really good results there. So I thought it was cool. Yeah, and cool it is. I think in addition to smart partnerships are also smart acquisitions. Right. And as we know, Ericsson acquired Cradle Point for over a billion dollars and uh, Reese is now in, in the process of acquiring Vonage for yeah. $6.2 billion. Yeah. And you know, clearly these bets are targeted at the enterprise space, the industry 4.0 arena. And I think this is uh, a smart uh, moves on Ericsson's part for the reasons you uh, outlined, Shelley, in terms of these, you know, really fascinating uh, partnerships and, you know, pushing forward yeah. uh, these uh, robotic capabilities, uh, which uh, always, you know, captures the imagination when you're seeing it being done in a uh, real world uh, fashion. But also, it's you know, quite simply a target rich uh, opportunity. It there are indeed. over 14 million <laughs> industrial sites around the world. Right. And uh, it, it, you don't have to capture every single one of them, obviously. But certainly, you know, a, a key percentage of that is just, you know, a, clearly a way uh, for Ericsson and its partners to define success, such as uh, Cool Morgan, which sounds like a really interesting prog band. And that's yeah. how I can remember the name of, the, of this new <laughs> partnership. It's, uh, it's definitely one uh, I'll be paying attention to. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Well, I thought it was, like I said, we're, you know, we're elbows deep in a research project on this very topic. And so it, what was happening there caught my eye. I thought it was interesting. 